Hi, I'm Holly Hutchinson, and you might know me as the Thrifty Mum. I am a family finance blogger for thriftymum.com, and I'm from Hull. So I first set up my website about five and a half years ago when I was pregnant with my eldest son, James. And I was in this Facebook group where everybody else was expecting at the same time. And there was this one girl and she said, you need your own website. I can't keep a track of everything that you're sharing because there's all the different chatter. So I thought, why not? So I started off my journey by purchasing the URL thriftymum.com. And then where I create the content and upload that to is called WordPress. And that's where I can set up all my different menus, all the different types of information. So it's all searchable as well. And that's really important for my audience to be able to dip in and out. Then it kind of snowballed. So I've always been interested in getting a bargain and car booting, going to charity shops, wanted to share my ideas about how to really stretch your money as much as possible. Yeah, you can call me a blogger, you can call me a writer, content creator. I do TV work as well as a consumer expert for Steph's Pat Lunch on Channel 4. But it all comes into Thrifty Mum. All the content needs to be aligned with my life and my, my kids' ages. So when I started the business, a lot of it was about pregnancy and then weaning and getting used to having to pay for childcare. And now it's about getting affordable uniform and different craft activities. I then use lots of different social media platforms. So Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, they're my main three. Utilizing LinkedIn to connect with brands as well has been really important to me. But having unlimited broadband with KCOM has been absolutely essential for me. Being able to utilize the Wi-Fi so I can sit in the garden with my children as they play and still do pieces of work has been excellent. It's been an amazing experience and they're not opportunities that I would have got if I hadn't have set up my own business and worked from home on that.